Hello, good morning viewers. In our previous lesson, we have seen how to measure angles using protractor. So in today's tutorial, we are going to learn how to construct angles using protractor. And in this tutorial, we are only going to be constructing 60, 90 and 200 degrees. So let us start with 60 degrees. The first thing we need to do here is to draw a straight line. So let me bring my ruler to do that. This is a straight line. Let me level it as point A and point B. You may choose point A or point B to be your origin depending on the direction you wish to construct the angle. Next, bring your protractor. This is my protractor. Let me extend it a little bit. You may take it to B or A. Let me take it to A. You can see that point A lies exactly on the point of intersection between 90 degrees and 180 degrees on my protractor. And you can see that this angle will be constructed towards the left hand side. Therefore, we are going to count anticlockwise. So use your pen to tick on 60 degrees on your protractor, which corresponds to 100 and 20 degrees clockwise. So this is the point. Next, remove your protractor, use the ruler to connect the dot and the O region, which is A. So I can use my line segment to do that. This angle right here is 60 degrees. Let me call this point point C. Therefore, C A B is equal to 60 degrees. So now let us construct angle 90 degrees. Draw a straight line. Level it as A and B. Still, I will be using A as my origin. Bring your protractor. Place it on A such that point A will lie exactly on the point of intersection between 90 degrees and 180 or 0 degrees on my protractor. Then we are going to tick on this line which is perpendicular to the horizontal line on my protractor which locates 90 degrees. I've added a point, take away a protractor, use your ruler to connect the dot and point A. So this is 90 degrees and you know 90 degrees, we don't have to write it. Let me call this point C. Therefore, C A B is equal to 90 degrees. Now let us go ahead and construct angle 200 degrees. But before we start constructing this angle 200 degrees, let us observe the angles on our protractor. You can see on our protractor, we only have from 0 to 180 degrees. So how can we construct 200 degrees? We know that we need 20 degrees extra for we to complete 200 degrees. So how can we do that? Let us construct our straight line. This is a straight line. Let me level it as a and B. This time around, I am going to construct the angle at point B. So let me bring my protractor, place it on point B. You can see this is a point B. And this straight line is 180 degrees, but we need 200. Therefore, we need 20 extra degrees to make it 200. So what we are going to do here is to play upside down our protractor to add 20 extra degrees. Now we are going to count clockwise 20 degrees. This is 20, I place a dot there. Take away your protractor, use your ruler to connect the dot and point B. So this is what we have. This 
angle right here is 200 degrees. Let me call this point C. Therefore, A, B, C, which is referred to as reflex, reflex angle A, B, C is equal to 200 degrees. Because if you say angle A, B, C, you are referring to this angle right here. But we just constructed the external angle, which is reflex to this angle ABC. And this is exactly how to construct angles using protractor. Thank you for watching. Do have a nice day.